Hi, I'm Dr. Sunny, and these are my bright ideas on public speaking. So we've been talking about the three P's of public speaking. Don't procrastinate, prepare, and our topic for this video, practice. Practicing your speech or not practicing it is the most common cause of not only communication apprehension, but of poor performance in student speeches. Before you even worry about practicing to give a perfect speech, which really isn't even possible since we all make mistakes, but anyway, you need to make sure that you've prepared your speech. Don't worry, if you missed it, I have a video for that. So let's say that you have prepared. You've tried video rough drafting, you've written an outline, you have great supporting evidence, you've tried reading your speech from your outline and it's the right length. Now what? Well, it's time to practice. Now, while I don't believe that practice makes perfect, everyone makes mistakes, it is the secret to speaking more extemporaneously, conversationally, speaking to your audience, whether they're live in real life or a virtual audience in a video speech. The first step is practicing. Read your entire outline out loud and record yourself. Cringe! The next step, watch the video while looking at your outline. No, really, watch the speech. Yeah, the whole thing. I know, everyone hates it. I hate it. While you're watching your speech, you need to make notes on your outline. Make notes where you need to speak more conversationally, make notes where things don't make sense, make notes where you say um all the time, these are the areas you need to revise. Next step, repeat. Do it again. Yes, again. As a matter of fact, I recommend you repeat this step 10 times for every speech you will give. It could take a few hours or days, but at the end of the process, you will be so much more prepared for your speech. You're also gonna feel a lot more confident about your topic. And this is why the most successful public speakers don't procrastinate on preparation. They know that forcing yourself to practice leads to success. My final tip for practicing, recruit your family and friends. Ask them to take just five minutes to listen to you deliver your speech. Be yourself in how you present your idea. And you might even consider, you guessed it, recording that rehearsal recording it in front of that audience to see how speaking to an actual human might make you appear more conversational and natural as a speaker. Are you looking for the secret to becoming a more confident speaker? Let's flip the switch. First, trick your brain with cognitive restructuring. Don't procrastinate. Prepare. That means research, write, revise, and finally, practice at least 10 times. You can learn more about these techniques in my Bright Ideas video series. I'm Dr. Sunny.